Ladies and gentlemen, we know for sure that punch hole infinity design is coming. And to show that there are many Galaxy S10 renders, but they all are renders. Nothing has come directly from Samsung until yesterday. A huge shout out to Mark Peters from Let's Go Digital for bringing out what could possibly be the actual closest to the real deal Samsung Galaxy S10 design. So here it is, the punch hole infinity design of the Galaxy S10, the Infinity O, has been found in Samsung's newest patent. According to Let's Go Digital, these are the first real images from Samsung Electronics showing a full screen smartphone with a camera hole in the display. The photos were used by Samsung Electronics in a design patent which was applied for at the HOG International Design System, where companies can file an industrial design patent which after approval can automatically be accepted by 70 different countries. This whole patent includes the images of the design so no text whatsoever. There are a total of 51 different designs attached to this patent, so many models but ultimately Samsung chose these four that they showed off at the developer conference and out of 51 different designs they only posted two color photos or you can say the render of a phone with the hole on the left. They obviously did that for a reason because this could be the closest and very well be the final design of the Samsung Galaxy S10. The two color photos have slightly different design in terms of shape. Uh, judging from that, I think the Model A could be for the Samsung Galaxy Note 10 and the Model B uh, is the shape for the Galaxy S10. It resembles the S9 Plus roundish look. Nonetheless, both are absolutely gorgeous, very thin bezels, almost non-existent. Display goes all the way to the top and I'm not gonna lie, this is very futuristic indeed. Now most of you guys agreed that the hole should remain in the center but Samsung has made some unique positioning decisions in the past so I do think that might have it on the left. Either left or in the middle is where the hole will most likely be. And a recent report from ET News has further revealed how Samsung has managed to make a hole in the display. The whole process is actually very challenging as Samsung uses flexible OLED display that has plastic substrate instead of glass. They have used laser drilling to make this hole. There's a huge chance that Galaxy S10 is indeed coming with the Samsung's unbreakable infinite display which uses a plastic substrate rather than a glass and it's going to be different compared to the Gorilla Glass 6. So there's a chance of that happening. Now what about the back? There is nothing shown regarding the back design of the Samsung Galaxy S10 within these patents. It's all about the front design but all about Samsung got a tip from a source and based on that they made a render as Eisenhower said earlier that cameras will be in horizontal position in order to give more space for the bigger battery. So this is how it may look. And yes, it does look very similar to the Galaxy Note 9. The differences between the S and Note lineups are getting even less. I do think it will have more of a S9 type rounded look overall but with the so this is the closest galaxy s10 look from samsung themselves let me know your thoughts in the comment section below also the antutu benchmark for the qualcomm snapdragon 8150 which is going to be the chip inside the us galaxy s10 slash china and the scores are pretty damn awesome 362,292, which is very close to the score of the iphone 10s max i do think that the exynos model can cross this benchmark number so i'm gonna wait for that but this is looking really really impressive as we know the apple 812 bionic chip is super fast and seems like the qualcomm's 8150 is matching almost matching that number and it is definitely way ahead of the huawei 20 pro screen 980 and compared to the s9 plus uh, which scored 263,000 score in undudu benchmark this is a huge huge jump indeed so yeah guys that's all we have on the Samsung Galaxy S10. This is again the closest look coming directly from Samsung through a patent, an exclusive leak indeed. And uh, again, let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.